Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and today we're going to present to you a 2010 Range Rover Sport. It's got the entertainment pack in the back and it's grey in colour with beige leather interior. It is the update series so it's got the much newer dash and the 3 litre turbo diesel V6. It's got a reverse camera, navigation, the car is in very good condition. Probably what's most amazing about this car is the fact that it's done 236,000 kilometres since it was new. But it has got a very good service history to it and drives perfectly. You can see here, next service Stuart Land Rover. So I'll just try and get it focused. Is 243,000 and it's done 236,000. So it's not overdue for a service. The timber work is excellent. It's actually got a two tone beige interior with black. Good thing about that is you don't get hand marks and things on the doors and the dash. It's got black Land Rover floor mats. It's a very good idea. The entertainment pack was a very expensive option. It does have the remote as well. The good thing about this update series with a three litre turbo diesel is they're economical, reliable, and they really do look fantastic. It's got the very nice Land Rover alloy wheel, which is originally only available on the supercharged V8 petrol. It's got a tow bar, and this car did come from the country, that's why it's done a few kilometres. For me personally, I don't mind if a car's done some kilometres if it's in good condition and it's been well serviced, which this car has. <coughs> the leather is excellent. I mean, if I didn't turn this video, I'd done 236,000 Ks and I'd said it had done 66,000 kilometres, you'd certainly believe it. The leather really is amazing. Look, a lot of people would think, oh, if a car's done 236,000 kilometres, the, the, the leather must be stuffed or at the end of its life. Well, the reality is that you don't wear out the leather from sitting in it. You wear it out from getting in and out of the car. And with these kilometres, the car's been on the freeway a lot. And that's why the leather's in such good condition. It has also been garaged. The headlights are in amazing condition. It does have Xenon headlights as well. And I honestly think it's incredible value for money. If you wanted a good turbo diesel 2005 model, the first of the series, you'd be looking at the same sort of money. For me personally, I would much rather buy an update series with a three litre turbo diesel engine, the newer dash lights, along with many other upgrades. The dash being the most important, I find that the, the 05 and the 06 models are just looking far too old. As you can see inside, the dash looks amazing. And from the inside, there's not a huge difference between this one and the current model. But I do agree that the, in that the five, the 2005 and six models are looking a bit dated. But grey with beige interior is a gorgeous colour combination. Grey metallic's easy to keep clean, and people think, oh, it's beige on the inside. You know. It's going to be so hard to keep clean. Well, the reality is it's very good quality leather. So if it gets dirty, you simply get some soap and water and you wipe it clean. It's very high quality. But if you've been looking at these, these Range Rover Sports, if you're looking at an 06 or an 07 model with 100,000 kilometres, I think it's worth coming in and having a look at this car. Take it for a drive. We can also offer an extended warranty if you wish. But I have driven it, and um, you know, Richard and I have driven probably more than 50 or 60 Range Rovers, if not more. And um, we certainly know what to look for. We've both driven this car, and we both think it drives beautifully. And we're sure you will think exactly the same. It's got a sunroof, which was an option. 
Uh, there's no damage to the car, there's no dents, scratches, scrapes. There's no gutter rash on the wheels. Admittedly, there's not many gutters in the country um, compared to driving around Sydney City. But uh, we're located in Marrickville. We're 20 minutes from Sydney Airport. We're in an undercover warehouse. And uh, we have three or four Range Rovers in stock at the present time. And so if you are looking for one of these Range Rovers, I would suggest coming in, have a look, ask for Philip or Richard, and we'll look after you. We'll take you for a test drive. But uh, I certainly don't think this is a car which will last very long. Thanks again for taking the time to watch our video, and we look forward to hearing from you.